Hello, this is Laurel from Laurel's Originals, and this is a video of how Martha and I designed a rug together for her kitchen. First, we took photographs of a beautiful table in her kitchen with yellow tiles and hand-painted colonial tiles, and we decided to enlarge one tile and put that tile design in the center of the rug. Okay, this is the enlargement that I got from the printers. Um, I asked for 16 inches. Actually, I had to ask in centimeters. And so it's just a little shy of 16 inches would be, uh, would be up to here on the four. And it's just a little bit in. It's maybe, I don't know, half an inch off, but that's okay. Um, and then because of the glare of the light, the border didn't come up very clearly. So what I did is I measured here, this is half inch, and then I went ahead and I measured by hand around the edge. So I knew that I had the um, border all the way around. So the sides were good, but then on the top, I had to make sure because the border doesn't end here. I have a border here that goes around the design, okay? And I'm not going to cut it out exactly. I'll probably take a bold marker and mark it out more clearly, but um, I like having the extra paper around the edge. So now what I want to do is, with this measuring tape, is I will find the measurement for the exact center, and then I'm going to go to this rug and I will measure the length and the width, and I will come to the exact center here in the center of the rug. And then I can place the center of the design in the center of the rug and anchor it down with um, carbon paper and trace the design on. Okay. okay, I've traced this design, and as far as I can, you know, as far as I know, I've done everything, but just, you know, I have the corners taped down. And so what you want to do is you just want to gently lift up and little by little take away your carbon. I like to use the black carbon because it doesn't smudge as much. This carbon paper was originally made for typewriters, okay? So that looks pretty good, but you see I still have my... my um, my design taped down just in case I missed anything. Let's check it over here. Aha! Okay. So look, I just missed a, a, a couple of lines. So what I'm going to do is sneak this back in there. It's taped down. I know it's in the same spot because I haven't taken up the whole design. And I'm just going to go ahead and go over those places that I missed. I just missed this little line here and I missed this little line here for some reason. Okay. Especially hard because I'm using a pen and I'm using it on a black and white paper. So I'm not always going to see. You might want to use a colored marker or... Okay, there we go. Alright. So now I'm going to pull this off. And I have this big tile right in the center of the rug. Now from here, I'm going to make some um, tiles to go around the edge. And I think here we're going to do a band of squares that will tie in the colors from here. So they'll look like just on the two ends. That was Martha's idea. Uh, this is for her kitchen. So, yeah. So, after you trace, just remember, keep it anchored down and just sneak a peek underneath and see if you've missed any place. Great. I'll see you in the next video. 
And here's the finished rug with the enlarged tile design in the center and we marked out the square yellow tiles around the edges. We used a dark red for the, it's the same color as the tile floor in Martha's Kitchen. So we use that as the color of the grout tile and the bands at the end of the rug give it some definition and incorporates the colors from the tile into and the ends of the rug. the rug in Martha's kitchen. It adds a beautiful pop of color to her dark kitchen floor. It goes beautifully with the tiled furniture in her kitchen and is a beautiful addition to her kitchen. It makes me happy, says Martha, to see this bright pop of color in her kitchen. If you would like to see more videos on how to design and create your own custom canvas rugs, subscribe to this channel and click on the notification bell so you'll receive notification when new videos come out. Thank you.